Hello guys again with another Cyberbunk 2077 video. In today's video we are fixing the downgraded graphics issue or the blurred textures issue with 1.6 patch. If you have played early batches you probably noticed as I noticed that the picture quality was clear and sharp enough. But after the batch there seems to be some downgrade in the resolution with blurred textures. Some people including me have encountered this issue and some people haven't. But if you are watching this video, that means you have the same issue. The thing is, after the batch, CD Projekt Red has implemented new graphics settings. Therefore, your old graphics settings have probably been reset. And since there are some changes in the graphics settings menu, we are readjusting them again, so let's get started. Let's open settings, then graphics. The first setting is quick preset. That one you change it on your own depending on how powerful your GPU is. After changing the other settings underneath it, it will automatically be changed to custom. Don't change it back otherwise all your settings will be reset again to the preset you have chosen. In my situation I use an RTX 3060 GPU so I will set the quick preset to ultra which is basically 1080p gaming. Texture quality set it to high, DLSS set it to quality, DLSS sharpness set it to a value equal to or higher than 0.2 depending on how sharp you want the image. I will set mine to 0.5. Dynamic resolution scaling set it to off, Fidelity FX super resolution aka FSR set it to off, Fidelity FX sharpening set it to off, field of view set it to 100, film grain set it to on, Chromatic Aberration set it to on, Depth of Field set it to on, Lens Flare set it to on, Motion Blur set it to high, Contact Shadow set it to on, Improved Facial Light Geometry set it to on, Anisotropy set it to 16, Local Shadow Mesh Quality set it to high, Local Shadow Quality set it to high, Cascaded Shadows Range set it to high, Cascaded Shadows Resolution set it to high, Distant Shadows Resolution High, Volumetric Fog Resolution Ultra, Volumetric Cloud Quality set it to Ultra, Max Dynamic Decal set it to Ultra, Screen Space Reflections Quality set it to Psycho, Subsurface Scattering Quality set it to High, Ambient Occlusion set it to High, Color Precision set it to High, Mirror Quality set it to High, Level of Detail set it to High. Ray Tracing Set it to off if you are using ultra quick preset or lower and set it to on if you are using a higher preset than ultra. Again that depends on how powerful your GPU is. That's it. These are the best settings for 1080p gaming that focus on the picture quality. If you are having lags or extremely low FPS lower than 40, you can lower these settings a little bit depending on what works with your GPU. I hope you find this video helpful to you. Thank you for watching and enjoy the game.